Hi everybody, welcome back to Majestic Collectibles, and here it is, Mystery Comic Book Long Box Search uh, 19, so there's 18, and that's the video I just shot, so that's some of the, uh, the good stuff that needs to be gone through and graded and bagged and boarded, so here's 19, if you guys get a chance, click like, hit subscribe, check out our other uh, unboxing videos, We've got action figures, comics, all sorts of fun stuff. Um, oh shoot, that's too many. I see it. You can see that's the very front one. I don't want to. I don't want to bend anything trying to get this first batch out. So I'll take a little smaller. All right, Venom. Always good. Good seller. Separation anxiety four and three and two. Did I got it. Did I get a one? Oh, my lunch is here. I'm going to take a break and I'll be right back. Ah, that was good. Double bacon cheeseburger from Sonic. Thanks, hon. Appreciate that. I've got uh, I've got a new employee of the month right there eating her dog treat. That's Princess R1, little red Boston Terrier. We don't have water in the house right now. They're doing some work. The joys of home ownership. They're uh, jackhammering our floor in our downstairs bathroom, and well, I'll save you the gory details. So anyway, back where we were, this is um, Carnage Unleashed. That was Separation Anxiety. So it is a different series, and I have two. Oh, I've got a number one. Of course, there's four of them, so I don't have that. Well, not yet. Might have it in a previous box. More turtles and high numbers. That's 70, 68, 66... Yeah, they're kind of scarce when they start getting up there. Oh, another $20.99. Oops, another $20.99. Princess Sally, that one's all right. Krusty, another Simpsons book. I got two, three. Those are okay. Oh, darn it. Look at that. Darn it. More Jurassic Park. Oh, the tragedy and horror. Boy, I like that. Oh, and there's a number nine. Another number nine. Those are good. Those are good. Oh, the dog's decided that she wants to leave, but she's not going anywhere for a while. Pull a few more of these out here. Boy, I'm seeing some good titles here. I have a whole bunch of these annuals from before, but I'm not going to complain. Eh, icons. Not a, you know, not a bad read, but nobody's collecting it. Gargoyles. Good book. I had one and two, I think... Is that the last video? I don't know. It wasn't too long ago. It might have been the storage unit video. So I'm happy with that. Uncle Scrooge. Yeah, yeah. Oops. Oh, good. More Snow White. That's uh, that's a little different edition of Snow White. Great cover. Not a high dollar book, but always sells. Barbie. Boy, you think that would sell, but I do not have a lot of luck with those. Little Mermaid, really good. Good book. Good book. Good book. Did you finish your treat already, dog? No, you're not going anywhere for a while, but but you can you can stare at me and sit in front of the door all you want. Another Aladdin. Uh, Cheryl had a few of those, but I will take them. Uh, okay, I think I've got enough room. I'm going to set these back, and then we can go through. Yeah, Aliens, always good. Aliens, Predator, always good. Angela, good. Aquaman, no, we're gonna we're gonna leave him right there. Nothing too exciting about Aquaman or Argus. Uh, there's the Super Teens. Uh, there's a little bit of a collector interest in it. There's some Archies. I'll pull those out for the Archie box. Argus, we're just we're gonna leave that right there. Uh, taking aim Avengers. That's what is that? 387 from 1995. Some good back stock. What is that? That's the, is that the next issue or the earlier one? These never want, run quite the direction. 387, and this is I can't see. Part four of four. So it must be that was two of four. So three, oh there it is, 388. I thought they'd have it up top like the other one. Azrael, uh, no, it's a number one. 
some low numbers. I don't know. I guess I'll set it aside, put it in the DC box. Oh, Babylon 5. It's not a photo cover, so that does hurt it, but I still have people, sci-fi horror guys, collect it. Detective. I got a lot of those. I'm not seeing anything, but I'll, I'll take them. Great black mask cover. So I still think he'd be a good villain. If you guys saw the, the last Batman movie with uh, Riddler, well, I still think Black Mask would fit in there. Oh, there's a Demon Entregan. Gotham Knights, I, I think I'm just going to leave. Let me pull these detectives out quick. And the Batman Annual. The Gotham Knights, I do not have a lot of luck with those. And I do have a pretty sizable quantity. I'll just leave them in the uh, DC box for future consideration. Shadow of the Bat. No. Oh, there's Beavis and Butthead. That's good. Oh, good cover, too. I'll have to see what that one's going for. I'm not sure anymore. I don't see a lot of those issues. Even in this collection, I've had a few. Betty and Veronica. All right. Bloodshot. Ah. Uh... They are a little higher number. You know, I'm going to do some research. I'll probably just go in an indie box for future consideration, but we're going to check it out. Uh, more cap, more back stock stuff. Casper movie. Okay, movie stuff sells a little better. Good. Catwoman. Three of those. Chapel, Cyberforce. Boy, I'm not seeing anything... Oh, there we go. That's that's a good book. I have quite a few of that issue. I recognize the cover. I got got a bunch of those in that uh, storage unit video. Same with that. But I'm going to pull them. Disney Afternoon's a good book. A little bit of a tough series to complete if you want them all. Uh, I don't know if it was just spotty distribution or what the reason was, but they they're just not an easy book. And these higher number Little Mermaids, which that's not a huge number, but it didn't didn't run very long I don't believe uh, but they start getting after the first four or five issues it gets real spotty there too mm, Gambit I'll throw that in the Marvel box Gen next nope I don't want to miss anything that techno yep there we go Ghost Riders good 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 uh, it's a number one impulse. I'm going to pull those because I do have some Flash people. Flash collectors. Let me rephrase that. Same with the Hulk. That's another Marvel title. I hardly had any of in these early videos that are starting to show up now. Uh, there's the DC Judge Dredd. I'll pull that. Yep, Archie and Ethel on the front of that one. Match made in... Um, well, made somewhere, I guess. JLA, great book. I'm going to leave it right there. Good. More Looney Tunes. Uh, that's the cartoon one, Marvel Action Hour. I usually leave that in the dollar box. They don't, even the number ones and things, just don't sell a ton. Same with that one, Marvel Action, Iron, um, Action Hour Iron Man. Uh... More Frankenstein, Mr. He, yeah, Hero Ninjack. Now I'm mumbling because the titles are not. Uh... Oh, Pull Power or Shazam. That's a, hard, that's a hard book too right now. I do not see a lot of copies. Ran and Stimpy. Robin with the spoiler cover, so that's good. That'll go in the Bat book. Oh, Rogue. That's in that uh, bad series at all. Grew, I believe those are the reprints. That's the image one, so I think those might be Dark Horse reprints. I'm not sure. I'd have to look. Great book, though. There we go. Silver Surfer. I don't know. Is that a higher number of Valiant? 48. Some of these Valiants, um, there was a period there where there just wasn't a lot made. Up South 7. That, uh, I'll pull it. Um, that some of those uh, Valiant books, they're kind of odd, not where you expect them to be valuable, but there are some that are really hard to get, so I have to 
research those. I never remember exactly which ones they are. Amazing Spider-Man 399. Spider-Man 2099 31. So again, getting up in the 30s on that 2099 stuff. Those higher numbers, again, like the Valiants, there's just some in there that uh, it's worth some money. Web of... Happy with that. Oh, Dark Empire 2. Great cover. Love the Han Solo Boba Fett. Which is not the Boba Fett from the TV show. This is the one that actually shoots guns and is, you know, kind of badass. Not not the guy that they got now. I don't know who that is. Bad batch of clones. I'm not sure. Uh, Superboy. I've been pulling those for just a back stock. Ah, uh, Superman. Oh my goodness, I have how many of those? One, two, three, four, five, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, thirteen, fifteen, whoops, I think sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six issues, and I know I found some in some earlier earlier boxes oh my gosh I don't know what to do with that I'll have to do some thinking I do not I do not need five copies of that let alone 26 but I got them yeah some more Superman I'll I'll leave it in the back stock box and I'll go through there and just fill out the ones I need for the shows coming up because I do not need to carry around 20 copies of Superman books uh, of each issue. Man of Steel. Uh, there's a Turok. I pull all the Turoks. I do have Turok buyers. You know, three, three to four dollar books. Most of them. Uh, again, there's some hard to find, so they, you know, if I get the right numbers, I might be okay. Another uh, Archie. Warblade. Uh, wet work. Supposedly that stuff's coming back. I don't know. They keep saying that Jim Lee, uh, you know, uh, is it Wildcats? Whatever else he did is going to be going to be some stories. What if Kingpin owned Daredevil? That's cool. I'll have to read that. I mean, research that. X Caliber. At least I have 26 issues of it. Uh, X Files. I throw in the sci-fi horror box, kind of along with the. Uh, Clive Barker stuff, not a not a big deal, but they are getting a little harder to find nice ones. They've been around long enough. X-Men Adventures, that's kind of dollar box stuff there. Wasn't a bad book, just nobody nobody's really after it or these right now. X-Men Classic, no, I thought maybe I might have a Good cover on there, but I did not. So we're coming to the end. Running out of space for any big keys. So nothing right now looks like big money or CGC worthy that I'm seeing. Uh, Valiant again. I don't know. I'll do some checking. I don't... XO, I really don't have a lot. No, I'm just going to leave them in here for now. I'm not really short on inventory. Um, so that's it. You know, just again... A lot of good backstock stuff. Uh, good chunk of Marvel titles. Again, not as much as the DC. Got that Snow White, couple of those sticking out. So that was a lot of fun. Right now, this is the last of the, uh, uh, the comic boxes I've got for a while uh, because I got to get to work. I got that's a video, that's a video, that's a whoop, that's a video, and then the stack behind it's a video. And that's the world-famous Princess Arwen who is just leaving the building on me. Uh, so that's it. Check out our other videos. And thanks for watching.